right, guys, today we're not going to be talking about Madden 22. We're not going to be talking about college football. We're going to be bringing it back into the wide world of NFL, and we're going to be talking about some Patriots news. Now, this isn't really like breaking news, but it's come out over the past couple of weeks and it's kind of build more uh build up more steam. It's it's been out there that it's it's been known that this person has been unhappy with New England and has uh kind of wanted given off the vibes that he wants to get out of there. And now it's built up a lot of steam and now it's come out that via his agent that he wants to uh, get traded. He's requested a trade. And this person in particular, I'm sure you probably already know, obviously you know from the thumbnail and the title, that it's Nikhil Harry. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with Nik Nikhil Harry, and why would you be? He really hasn't been that much for the Patriots over the past couple of seasons. He was drafted in the first round of the 2019 NFL Draft. He was the Patriots' first round pick in that draft. Uh, 32nd, I think it was, that they took him. Maybe 31st, something like that. But he was in the first round of the 2019 NFL Draft. And ever since he's been in the league, he really hasn't had that much production. He, to be fair, he's played with Tom Brady for a season. And then he played with Cam Newton for a season. So, I mean, he really hasn't had consistent quarterback play for the two years that he's been in the league. And he hasn't really pro produced like you would think, like his expectations would have... Uh, insinuated that he'd play like because coming out of Arizona State Nikhil Harry was thought to be one of the best wide receivers in that class and he really hasn't panned out now maybe that's because he's just not built for the NFL maybe that's because he just he's not that good or it could be the fact that he just didn't fit with the Patriots the Patriots just didn't use him correctly and that could that could very well be a possibility and so there's not a lot of uh, steam behind who's involved with potentially putting a package together for Nikhil Harry. I wouldn't imagine it would be anything crazy, maybe like a lower level player and maybe like a third or a fourth round pick. I wouldn't, I wouldn't think we'd be getting a second or a first, definitely not a first for Nikhil Harry, the way that he's, uh, put up production, but I don't think Nikhil Harry's that bad of a player. He just hasn't really gotten, I wouldn't say he's gotten, he hasn't gotten a lot of opportunities because he's been out on the field but he just, I don't know, he hasn't produced like he he was thought to have been able to produce coming out of college. And I've heard that the Ravens could be a potential trade partner with the Patriots for Nikhil Harry, another big option, big target for Lamar Jackson. Uh, I think the Dolphins might be involved with a possible trade for Nikhil Harry to give uh, Tua another target to go along with. So my thing, my whole thing with Nikhil Harry is... I think he's still got potential. I think he can still work out in the league. I don't think he's a total just throwaway bust like some wide receivers have been in the past. But I think with the right coaching and the right situation, Nikhil Harry could end up being a pretty productive wide receiver. I'm not saying that he's going to ever become the number one wide receiver on a team or he's never, he's ever going to become like the best wide receiver in the league or even a top 10 wide receiver in the league. But he's got potential to be a very productive, maybe 607 yard receiver uh, a year 60 70 catches he could he could be in that range he could be a two or a three on a on a really good championship team he's never going to be a one i don't think he's got that potential i don't think he's got that uh skill level to be a one but he's definitely got the potential to be a two or a three and rack up six seven hundred even eight hundred yards maybe even a thousand yards in a season if he has a really like breakout season or something on on a on a really good team and he's in the right situation uh, just it turns out that the Patriots aren't the right situation. And I can't blame it. It's hard to be a, a New England Patriot. It's hard to to fit the Patriot way and to to fit that system. You have to be a very specific player. You have to be a very specific person to fit that system and to, and to be able to play in New England. And, and some people, it's just not cut out for them. So I wish Nikhil Harry all the best. I will do a um, a reaction video if or when he gets traded and to who and for what. I will do a reaction video to that, but this video is basically just me uh, reacting to the news that he has requested a trade, even though I know that the news isn't really breaking or anything. It's not It's not new news that he's requested a trade, and it's not new news that he's unhappy in New England, and I understand. I understand why he's not happy. He wasn't really getting a lot of targets. He wasn't getting a lot of playing time last season, so 
it's been kind of up and down for him, but I still personally think that he's a talented wide receiver. I think he could possibly, like I said, be a two or a three on a really good championship team. He's not going to be a one, but he could be a two or three, fit in there, maybe catch a couple deep balls, run down the middle of the field, catch some slants, something like that. He's a big body guy. I think he's like 6'5", six, 6'4". Six, he's probably in the 230-pound range. I don't, I don't really know what his, his, his weight is, but he's a big body guy. He can go up on one-on-one 50-50 balls and, and bring them down most likely, depending on what the quarterback situation is. So it sucks that he wants to get out of there because I still think he could be really good for the Patriots, but if they want to trade him and if he wants to get out of there, then there's not really much else that can happen. I think I feel like those bridges have been burned and uh, the Patriots are going to do everything they can to, to send him on his way because the Patriots really don't have any sympathy for anybody. Uh, they they tend to ship out people before you'd think that they'd want to, but Nikhil Harry wants to. So let me know down below in the comments what you guys think. If you guys think that Nikhil Harry is a good fit for the Patriots or if you think that he's actually a really good player and he's just in a bad situation or if you think that he's a bad he's just a bad player in general. He's going to be a bust. I don't know. Let me know. And also let me know down below what you guys think the possible trade option is. Who's the trade partner the Patriots could uh, work with to send Nikhil Harry on his way. Let me know down below you guys' thoughts on that. That's going to do it for me, though. Thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching. Make sure to smash that like button, notification bell, and the subscription button as well. Join the Juice Club, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!